This need a hunchback of Notre Dame. Lord is the best medicine. I hope Quasi is okay out there, Laverne said fretfully. The other two girl girls in the bell tower, Hugo and Victor, nodded in agreement. Their friend Cosmato had just left Notre Dame to help the younger soldier Phoebus search for the Court of Miracles. It was sure to be a dangerous mission. The only things we could do are stay strong and be helpful, Victor said solemnly. Hugo smirked. How can we not be strong, he said. We're made of stone, remember? <laughs> Good one, Laverne giggled. Rock solid. You know that's not what I meant. Victor frowned at his friends. And both of you, don't you have any sense of the seriousness of this, the seriousness of this situation? Our dear compadre is out there somewhere facing grave peril. Grave peril? Laverne said. Way to be optimistic, Victor. <coughs> Excuse me. You've already got poor Quasi in his grave. I see, Victor said sternly. So you two would rather mock me and crack bad jokes than join me in my concern for poor young Quasimodo? Laverne stood up and brushed herself off. Why does it have to be an either-or thing, Victor? She asked. Just because we're laughing, it doesn't mean we're not worried, too. Hugo nodded. If we spend all our time thinking about how terrible everything is, we'll go nuts. <laughs> waving his friend, Waving his friends. <laughs> waving his arms to help make his point, Hugo accidentally hit a bird's nest that was tucked into one of the eaves. The occupant of the nest squawked, squawked and flew upward. Laverne ducked just in time to avoid having the bird fly straight into her face. <clears throat> Excuse me, but then she tripped and fell and wound up on the ground. The bird banked upward, still squawking as it flew over Hugo. Hugo leaped backward and landed on Laverne's hand. She yelled and yanked her hand out from under him. Hugo lost his foot and landed in a leap in a heap on top of Laverne. Victor stared at his friends who were trying to untangle themselves. Then he started to laugh. He laughed harder and harder until he could hardly speak. You know, he said finally, I think he just might be right. I feel much better already. <laughs> the end.